Good evening. I'm Jackie Parks. And I'm Tim Callahan. You will have a chance to weigh on how key grand dollars will be spent right here in Bakersfield. Officials are hosting workshops that will help reshape neighborhoods and focus on affordable housing, homelessness, and economic development. 23 ABC's Carlos Cray live tonight in downtown where officials are deciding where all this money will go. Carlos. The city anticipates getting $4 million as part of its five-year consolidated plan. Now, the input the city gets from the community will help decide which project gets funded. Victoria Golden has a few ideas of how to improve the Bakersfield community. I believe it should go for the low-income disabled people. Golden wants to make sure her voice is heard as she takes part in the first community workshop on the city's community development block grant program and other HUD-funded projects. I know that they need their input. They're not aware where the funds can be allocated, what, what they can use the money at. Input gathered from the meetings will help city officials identify and set priorities for the allocation of HUD funding in the five-year consolidated plan. I'm sure we in, include the community about the needs of the homeless. That's a, a very serious uh, issue and, and we want to uh, help address that. Um, just uh, public safety is, is another one, making sure we're doing it in a way that is going to make the community as safe as it can be. The city will get an estimate amount of $4 million from the federal government. We want to spend that money in the best way possible. In years past, money from the same grant was used on building the planned skate park and even the gym at the Martin Luther King Jr. Community Center. We can improve the physical condition of, uh, of the neighborhoods. We hopefully that will help to bring up property values and, and pride. Money has also been put into several neighborhood streets, gutters, and new housing. This next round of funds will continue honoring the needs of the community. Well, we have also have an economic development strategy that we're uh, working on where we have five economic opportunity areas that we've identified, and they are mostly in the more economically challenged uh, parts of the city. So, yes, all that is we, we want to improve every part of Bakersfield. The final plan has to be approved by the Bakersfield City Council and submitted before the May deadline. Now, Jackie, the next community input meeting takes place in November.